So you go around Hong Kong, you set yourself a nice lap, you think to yourself, that's a good one. You have a look at the time and you are what, two, three, four, five seconds behind the better ones, whether that's group A, group B or even group C. You're a few, good few seconds behind them. So you have a little look and do a ghost challenge against some of the other, other ones, not necessarily right at the top, but people above you. You look at them and they're all crashing and banging into the wall. So you think, oh, that's obviously the trick. So what do you do? You go out and start banging the wall. And what happens? This is what happens usually. So, why are we getting an invalid lap and the others aren't getting an invalid lap? The reason is this, the angle you're hitting the wall is too severe. The angle has to be shallow. If you look at the front left wheel, the outside edge of the tyre, that is the point at a shallow angle you need to hit the wall. If you're hitting it at a steep angle, you will either get stuck or an invalid lap. If you do it at a shallower angle, so about a 10 degree angle, somewhere around there, it will slow the car down and it'll also bounce it, depending on the corner, and you won't get an invalid lap and you'll get round the, um, obviously round the corner a lot quicker. So let's have a little look at a lap and you'll see what I mean by the shallow angle and I'll run a chase view replay afterwards and you'll see it. So it's a front left wheel outside edge tyre 10 degree angle roughly is what you want to do and obviously then it's going to be down to practice here we go 10 degree angle a third of the way along the blue wall it will then bounce around don't worry about the back because the back won't fail you to slow down here there's a sign you want to hit just before the sign at a 10 degree angle or sign up here on the left and that will slow the car right down that will take practice you won't do it straight away but uh, I'm not going to worry about these because these are just normal driving around these this one again sort of two thirds away along same angle and it will bounce off around now but again it's going to take practice all these are just normal and here I messed this corner up here I just just touched that corner I was actually on the same time as my uh, better time uh, but this shows you just driving that clean that would have been exactly the same time as this as you know i'm not a great lover of time trials so i am um, i will probably invest a bit of time uh towards the end of this uh obviously to get into group a uh, and i was going to run through the chase view now for you As you can see here, second wall going to bounce it, well not bounce it, slow it down just before the sign. Uh, that takes the most practice, that one I would say. Here it's just all about your just driving ability through these couple of corners here. I actually took this corner quite badly on my better time. Here is a bounce again, a shallow one, and the car will naturally just follow it around here. And up here, I messed this corner up unfortunately, but and I lost about half a second there but if you just you know just touching all the bit and you don't fail then you you know you can either lose half a second or you can sort of gain a second on the good corners so each of those three main corners you will gain probably between 0.7 and one second um, per corner bang if you like and the more you do it obviously like anything else the better you will become at it uh, some people invest a lot more time than I do, but uh, anyway, it, it, will chop, it will chop off probably, I would say, two and a half to three and a half seconds, roughly, uh, from your best time just driving around the time, or a good time, not your best, but a good time. And everyone's doing it, so you might as well just join in, you know, in my opinion, it's everyone's doing it, so if you don't do it, then you're, uh, you know, it's there. And is it a skill? I would say, yeah, it is a skill. Uh, a lot of people would just say, no, I'm not doing it. I wouldn't do it. It's you know, it's just stupid. A lot of people have said that in the past, and they're all doing it now, every single one of them. So they just don't understand how to do it. Uh, once they do understand how to do it, and there's gold to be had, 
uh, they'll all, you know, they're near enough, all will be doing it. So uh, I personally think it's a skill, and the ones at the top are, you know, very skillful way, and they've spent time. It don't just come naturally. It, um, you know, it's something you have to practice and become good at. Uh, hope that helps you. Uh, let me know uh, if it does. Uh, see you on another one soon. Cheers.